We got D here. You know, he's another satisfied customer, and uh, he's gonna give us testimony on. You know, D, what, what what's the reason you come here? Well, I was told about this place about four years ago. I got three brothers that've been here. One plays for the 49ers. One plays baseball for the minor leagues of the White Sox. Okay. And my father's been bringing us them here for about four years, and I've been going to a barber out north for about ten. Okay. Came to see Steve. Okay. This would be my third time since since this interview. Every time he's gotten better, so I think I may have a new barber down the street. Okay. So 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 what do you think is different from here and all the other shops? You know what I'm saying? Like you know you can you can stop by any barber shop and and, and get a haircut. You know what I'm saying? So what do you think that you know that Bronzeville Barber Salon you know provide? You know that that you think is different from anything else? I would have to, I would have to say one thing I like though this is this is more for the kids is when I came in here my second time a, a song came out with cursing and they turned it off so uh -huh. it's definitely a place I recommend for I'm 30 years old so I know a lot of people with kids that I would tell kids to come here uh -huh. number two I scouted you guys like I said my brothers my father so well so what do you mean by scouting I, I you know just in case you know you know the people don't understand what what is what do you mean by scouting. I just observed. I, I looked at them. I asked them where they got their haircut. You know, I don't know they came to this spot. And the more I heard about this spot, you know, I, I started looking to see what they were doing. You know, the way they, they uh, lined it up. And I have a different type of hair than most uh, brothers out there. So. Right, right. Let me let me actually check that haircut out, man. Steve just did it. Oh, man. That's, that's, not, that's hot, man. Yeah. Yeah, you do have a different type of texture and everything. Okay. So you so you just kind of scouting them out and everything. So 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 you saying it's kind of hard to do your hair or something like that? Absolutely. I mean, I travel about four months out of the year. Okay. So I try to get my hair cut before I go on the road because mm -hmm. I ran into many. I don't know how many bad barbers throughout the country. Mm -hmm. Throughout the country. Country. I travel. Yeah. Okay. Nationwide. Um, actually, the guy I used to go to did. He used to do. Uh, what's the hip hop guy? Okay. Skateboard, kick push. Oh, so he's, oh, um, Lupe, Lupe he did, Fiasco. He did Lupe. Okay. And then my other guy before that, I talked to a guy who won a couple of, I don't know, barber tournaments in Joliet. Okay. Oh, you that's know, um, yeah, I know what you're talking you about. You know, I talked. Yeah. Yeah, him. So mm -hmm. I've gone through. I think I want this will be my third barber mm -hmm. in my life in Chicago, so or Illinois. I'll okay. go drive to get a good haircut. All right, guys. This is another satisfied customer. This is D. So if you ever see him out, you know. You know, ask him where the spot at, you know, and he going to be fresh, you know what I'm saying? So, peace out.